With the current form of Warsaw, I won't lie, I don't know how I'm still in a job. Things ain't going very well for Warsaw. Fucking battle the channel. Time to see us try not to lose again, I guess. Would you believe it that my job's actually secure? S somehow my job status is secure. I mean, we're 16 from the league now. I've not seen a loss run like this ever in the history of playing this game. I thought last season was bad. I feel I think this is much worse. Look at all those reds. Oh well, welcome back to the channel. If you are enjoying the series, as always, make sure you hit the subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up. Leave a comment around cheer me up and try and work out what on earth is going wrong. Last time out you saw us, we lost the Nottingham 2-0. And then... I mean, we might have turned it around here. Okay, we'll get into it though, we'll get into it. Most recently, following the last game you saw, Luton, a 1-1 draw. Again, we we're, were missing a few players through injuries still. People weren't up for it, man, at all. Luckily, Long's left in the penalty spot. Early on, got that one goal for us. Collins equalised. The game was dead. Literally, the game was dead after this. Nothing else happened. There's no other highlights. The entire game wasn't absolutely right off. So, we won't go too much into the looting game because there's nothing to talk about, really. West Bromwich Albion, local derby. We're back against the baggies again, a local derby. And we, we lost again. Colin Grant opened the score with the seven minutes. And literally, we did nothing for the longest amount of time. You see, even the possession stats. We had a few shots, but nothing great, like, worth speaking about. Adams popped up with an equaliser and then Baker in the 90th minute. Bloody Lewis Baker, we were after you so long last season. And you do that to us. I'll never forgive you, Lewis Baker. So, next up was Stoke, away from home. I mean, a game in which I thought we should probably get some points out of, but I mean, Sodji scored, had one disallowed, scored again before we actually started doing something ourselves, which wasn't enough though again. Far from it. More getting one back, but you see here, 6.5, 6.4s, just not good enough in the attacking line. We're not getting nothing up there at the moment. Can't seem to get the goals. We're missing out on a few people again. You can tell from the other games as well, it just wasn't happening for us in attack. Again here, well, this is, this is the one that frustrated me the most. Look at all we did in this game. How we did not win this game is unreal. 17 shots, 5 on target. So yeah, this is a frustrating one really against Reading. A game which is dominated. The XG is mental in our favour. Longstaff missing the penalty, which was a pain. But I mean, it's a game we should have won. How we didn't win it is actually unbelievable. But again, you see here, nothing really happened in the attacking line. We're getting shots off in these games as well, but nothing is really happening in terms of getting goals. Poor. And again, it happened. Brentford this time, we just we couldn't get past them. Couldn't get any goals. Consider got sent off. Klukas injury. Clough have on this allowed. But again, it's these goal things here. Conceding too many and not doing nothing the other end of the pitch. We're getting well with possession. He had an XG 1.37, but didn't get the goal. Just didn't get another goal. And then most recently, we actually only won a game. I mean, is this the turnaround now for us? We hope so. Pinas came back in the striker as well, which is great. You can see here, long stuff about an 8.1. Klukas 7.1. Things start to turn around a bit by the looks of it. Hogwarts had one disallowed as well. But he did get one, which is great to see. Longstaff getting one. Pinas with the third. Amazing stuff. 3 1 victory against Millwall, which now sees us sitting all the way down here in 16th. Do you remember the start of the season? We were up here and we was like, oh, maybe a playoff, but nah. That's gone. I think we're not in the bottom. We're still quite safe at the moment. We're on 22 points. You can see the MK Dons are on 14 and 13 below, then 11 for Luton at the bottom. So it's not end of the board right now, but there's still a lot to work on. I mean, you see how close it is here. We're in 22, 23 points up to the 13th where Bristol are, and then from that 26 upwards, I mean, anywhere between 13th and 18th, I'd take this season. It's an improvement. It's not a relegation battle, it's definitely an improvement. So we'll see how things go. We're going to today's lineup and today's game against Norwich. So on today's starting 11, just having a line up for this game. Man in the net, Kinsella, Ineos, Ballard and Kunku at the back. Pozo playing that CDM role, it's his first game for the club, he hasn't played yet, so 
So he gets on. We put more into a more advanced role in CM. More winning field midfield though. So we'll see how he gets on there as well. Should be interesting. Long staff is a box to box as always. Smashing it all season so far. McDonald, Hogworth, Pinyas up top. They just really need to pull their finger out today and actually get some goals for us. It's a massive game away at Norwich. It's going to be hard to get any points in this game. So we're hoping for a lot. Let's see how the boys get on. So here we go then. Away at Carrow Road. A massive fixture. A Norwich side to probably look at all Macron Rush in this season or try and win the league. I'm not sure where they are in terms of the league table right now, but. Oh, what was that ball? Pozo's debut, and he's just made the worst pass I've ever seen in full manager. In Norwich, a second. Not really surprised, though, is it really? Tossard. I wonder if it's on Tossard from Brighton as well. I mean, he shouldn't be in the championship. Not at all. Gibson. Carreza as well. Oh my god, man. This team is unreal for the championship. Jao Pedro. Please tell me that's Jao Pedro as at Watford. And then Nico Williams on loan for Liverpool. Of course. Of course, they got him as well. He caused a problem last season, didn't he, as well? He did. If I remember correctly. Big ball in. Gibson heads it. Man, him a big save. That would do. More of that, lads. Here now with a free kick. He finds Nitchum. The silver. Elise. Nitchum again. Back to Gibson now. I mean, this Norwich side is very good. I love it's good enough for the Prem. But in terms of like the quality they got here, it's like, probably the best in the Championship right now. Some of the players have got absolutely unreal for this level. More now. Oh. I mean, simple pass. Simple passes are needed and just not happening. Williams now, finding some room on the right hand side. I get a ball to the box here. He does. Pedro! He's going to get in the middle, play in his beats him to it. Miranda now on the left. Back into the box. Oof. Lucky we toss side. Lucky for us, though. Lucky for Warsaw. We stay alive. And Kunku now on the left hand side. If we can make something happen for me, that'd be great. Pozo. Oh, he's lost it again. Why are we giving this guy a chance? Pedro's through and yeah, Zab Pedro scores his six for the season. All because the debutant Pozo just passed the ball straight to him. Corner now for Warsaw. Pozo takes it himself here. Ballard, Hogworth, he's got it in. An equaliser for Warsaw here, completely out of nowhere. There's like nothing all game here. I mean, I'll give I'll give Pozo the benefit of the doubt. He's actually done something good here with this corner. Straight in, Ballard heads it, and Hogworth, I think it was going in. Probably feel bad for Ballard, really. He's probably going in by himself. But Hogworth taps it home. Norwich 1, Warsaw 1. Williams now with the throw. And finds Tossard. Back to Cahir. Keep seeing these players. I'm just thinking, how are they playing the championship? Some of them are unreal for the championship. Miranda now. Ball to the box. Tossard. Cleared up by Pozo. Each one goes through, but Pinas beats him to it. Come on, Pinas. Drive, buddy. Drive. Oh, I took a tackle from Nietzsche. No, I'll give him credit for that one. Corner for Warsaw. We've scored from one corner already. Can we do this again? Pozo. Behind the corner. Goes short to Longstaff instead. Now falls into the but it's offside. What are you lads doing? Well, back at the other end of the pitch now. Is Nitchum gets the ball from the throw in. De Silva. Back to Nitchum. Williams. Trying to find a bit of space to get a ball across the box here. He finds out Pedro. A Mannion. Very good save. Luckily for us there. Mannion's had a half decent season so far. I do feel bad for him. We came in last minute. Oh my gosh. I was just about to say how good he's been doing, but I mean, again, it was tipped into their own goal. So, there's only a few episodes, the exact same thing again. Not good, not good. We're going to half time. 1 1. It could be worse against Norwich. Dream, I've been saying this team's really good. I could see we're in the second in the league. We're away from home. I'll take a draw right now against these. Let's see how it gets on the second half. First hole out of the second half. Give me a corner now for Norwich. Plus, I'll swing into the box. Miyazaki's is there, and what a bullet headed from him. Luckily, here's the crossbar. Goes for a goal kick. We'll take that. We'll take that all day long. We're back again now. Throwing this time. Manny and Major collected, though, from the flick on. What can he create from here? Gone for the long ball. Found McDonald. Hogwell can get it. Williams blasts it forward and said, Ineos now. End to end at the moment. You can see that Ineos smashes it forward again. Absolutely no one. Nietzsche, Alisi. Loads of room for Williams on the right hand side. He drives inside. Finds Tossard. What a challenge from Hodgeworth, by the way. Absolute great challenge from in. Care gets it now. Plays it back forward again to Williams. End to end stuff at the moment. Norwich looking like they're more likely to get a goal first, though. Miranda gets the ball now on the left. Ball into the box. Toss out. Alisi still going around it as Unconcu puts it out. So we've done a change now for Warsaw. Hodgeworth has gone up front now for a bit. Pinyas on that right hand side. Stevens comes on the left now instead. Switch it out a little bit. It says it gets on for McDonald does come off now. I mean, we'll have to switch some things around, try and make something happen, try and get a winner out of this. 
I'll just say that he's going to be a corner that over in the pitch now. So at least swings into the box. Gibson and what's over from Mannion. 15 minutes to go. Still aiming to try and get a victory out of this one. It'll be a massive result if we can get something out of this. There's, it's going to be a free kick now because we're all hard offside. He's in his own half and he has the ball. Kabalnik now drives forward for Norwich. Trying to find an option. Here's Miranda on the left hand side. Yeah, he's waiting for that ball to the box. Thomas has a go. It's straight into Mannion's arms. We've just under 10 minutes to go now. Mannion's got the ball in his hands. Hopefully, he can create something. He ever kicks out of his hands. I mean, it's took his time here. Yeah. Big ball forward just to get possession away anyway. Brownick. We can't go with the interception, but just go straight back to Norwich. Norwich dominating the play. It's only a matter of time before they get a winner here by the looks of it. So Williams drives now, coming to the box. Kapalnik, Thomas, oh, Mannion with a great save at the back stick. Gibson now, on his left-hand side, he's driving forward. There's no options in the box yet. He's waiting for someone to make the run. Still needs to be careful. Kapalnik, headed back to Miranda, let it go from distance, and Kinsella smashes it out for the corner. Norwich corner, five minutes to go. Anything can happen. Did we say that? Williams had the throw, at least see. Cabal Nick swings it into the box. Gibson again this time. Still no goal. Norwich are pushing for this goal. We're going to go attacking. We're going for this now. There's definitely a chance if we can get something. We can get the right count on the go. It's Cahia. Cabal Nick. Nietzsche. Cahia. Thomas. Williams and Wallace from Mannion again. I mean, a draw is a massive result against Norwich away from home. But if we can somehow steal this, we've just a minute to go. We are pretty huge. Cahia now drives into the box. Williams. Oh. So close again. Norwich really pushing for this. They need to go now. Longstaff gets the ball. Flicks it to Stevens. Oh, I should play to Hodgeworth. He's through then the first time. Oh, Stevens. What has he done there? The chance was on to get a winner for Warsaw, and Stevens just doesn't do the pass. As Williams drives forward now. If the, and Norwich get a winner now. Oh, my days. What was that clearance? Give me a goal for Warsaw. And this is surely be full time. We have 10 seconds to go. Manny in the play out from the back. That's gonna be it. Doesn't even play the goal kick, just keeps the ball, take the draw. It's a massive point against Norwich, to be honest. I won't lie. It's something I didn't expect to get today. I was kinda of expecting the look. I mean, look at them stats. We don't deserve a point, do we? Twenty one shots, ten on target to our two shots, one on target, the one we've scored as well. Uh everyone thought we'd get beaten to that. Yes. We did all think we get a beat, and we didn't. So with that result, a 1-1 draw against Norwich, who are second in the league. It does see Walsall rise to 14th now on the table. A massive point take on the road at Cara Road. Huge stuff for Walsall. Let's carry on next episode. Thank you so much again for watching. We have to be in Walsall FC. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you're interested, of course. I'm not going to force you to do it, of course not. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.